hello guys this is pawan from mbutronics so today i will tell you how we can we can toggle an led in 8051 so i'll start with uh, how to make an project in uh, keel microvision so we'll go to the project new microvision project and i uh, will give it a right name let's say toggle led and here we'll choose the legacy device database and here i'll search 8089 c51 and here uh, this is the 8051 based fully static 24 megahertz cmos controller so we'll select this and uh, we'll copy this overwrite it now we'll choose new file and here we will write our code so uh, hash include first we'll uh, add our header file which is rec 51.h for 8051 now in the main while infinite loop we will go with that and um, here we will uh, our body of the code will be there so here let's say we will take port 2 so p2 equals to uh, i will toggle this led using only single instruction so first uh, uh, we will uh, write p2 equals to uh, p2 or with equals to let's say fourth led fourth pin i want to toggle one left shift fourth starting from zero and uh, then a little uh, loop delay where computer will uh, your controller will not do anything so for i equals to zero i less than let's say thirty thousand i plus plus so this will just copy and here instead of this it will go add and here complement so p2 equals to uh, p2 or with one left shift equals to one left shift 4 and uh, here our uh, controller will not do anything for this particular counting till 30,000 so okay let's uh, just save this file uh, T O G G L E and uh, we will also add this in source group toggle LED dot C. Now we will just uh, four errors. Oh, we did declare an I uh, show unsigned int I. Now I will just. okay again we are getting some error oh I instead of semicolon I put colon here okay I won't get any error now 0 0 only so I'll show you this uh, blinking in uh, uh, the debug portion itself of our 8051 keel software so let's select peripherals go to the port 2 and here if I'll run this using this icon so fourth pin of this uh, 0 1 2 3 4 so this uh, pin will uh, just uh, uh, enable and disable so let's run it so here you can see it's enabling and disabling so this way it's blinking is uh, happening and if i want uh, now to be able to make this thing uh, using only single instruction uh, means like uh, with delay and uh, only single instruction if i want to execute this toggling so i will use one more bitwise operator that is xor so let's xor this and build this and uh, debug 
so now you can see here only one single instruction I have uh, put and then after that delay is there so let's debug this and if I'll run so same way uh, we will see the blinking so here you can see fourth pin is blinking so I hope you like uh, this tutorial if you have any doubt regarding this just feel free to comment us below and uh, please subscribe our channel till then thanks